Moving on from data encoder. How a debugger works. It's magic. Yeah. So we talked a little bit about this in the last class. Although for those of you who took it a year ago, I don't believe Matt covered debugging in intro RE at that time. He, he may have actually along the way. Okay. Um, really quick, we, we talked about hardware versus software breakpoints and, and step into versus step over. Um, those are, are your basics. Um, one thing to know is when you load up something in a debugger, that means you are running it. And depending on the different options um, that, that you select within the debugger, um, tells the debugger when to halt execution because there's a bunch of um, kind of setup code that can happen that the debugger can identify and skip over for you if you want it to. With regular programs, cool, that's fine. Stuff like malware can be a little more insidious and might try to run some, some stuff kind of behind the scenes, as it were, if you try to skip over the, the normal just kind of setup code. And we'll, we'll see that. Um, the, whole, the whole how software breakpoints actually modify the cold code versus hardware breakpoints set a, a register in the CPU, very important to remember. 